Hi guys, how are you? Um, interesting chart here updated. The Trololo chart. Um, so we went up a lot uh, in crypto from about 250 billion to about 350 billion here the past two weeks or so. 250 to 350. Um, uh, but the trend line is uh, only at 409 billion. It's going up slowly, uh, but not fast. So, but that means we're almost at the same valuation. And so, it's so you can say uh, crypto is fairly valued now, about the same as the average price, which is the red line. But um, the question is, what's going to happen next? And the pattern that I see is the pattern of 2011, for the most part, collapse very hard, strong rebound, deeper rebound, but lower high. Huh? higher low huh? lower high and no he's no he's not crash and 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 another one another lower high uh, lower low sorry so um yeah uh, same pattern here a big crash rebound collapse but a lower low huh? rebound but a lower high collapse a lower low again huh? this uh, we are really on the bearish trajectory still except if we set a higher high here so it will be interesting to see what happens uh, over the next few weeks um but it is most probable that we will not i this was not the bottom in undervaluation we never saw the bottom only hit once in every bear market and early bull market the bottom was tested multiple times here too huh? so that's why it's likely to at least retest or set a, a, a higher low uh, uh, if you come out of it. But um, yeah, um, that's 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 what I'm seeing. Um, uh, uh, due for a due for a correction in the crypto is I think. Uh, yeah, uh, Bitcoin Cash 280. I think it's relatively cheap still, even though you can say crypto is fairly valued. But Ethereum went up a lot more than Bitcoin Cash, for example. Bitcoin is also holding strong and still at the market dominance of 60%, which is very high. Um, but dominance is trending down. It has peaked uh, out uh, some time ago. Uh, right here. And it's already a long time ago at 70%. In September 2019, almost a year ago. So it's going down. Huh? Um, Likely going to go down a lot. So I think Bitcoin Cash is still a good investment. Ethereum is uh, already uh, fairly priced, and uh, for sure, actually. Um, and, uh, and Bitcoin also, Bitcoin Core, but Bitcoin Cash not. Um, but of course, uh, when it comes to my uh, investment plan, um, I don't buy anything. Uh, uh, what I do is uh, converting Ethereum into Bitcoin Cash. Yes, uh, and that's how I build my continue to build my Bitcoin Cash stash because uh, that's very interesting. Uh, what? Oh no, not not Ethereum. But let's take a look at the price of a Bitcoin Cash in Ethereum. So we go to Bitcoin Cash uh, chart. in ethereum uh, last last year uh so here you see it's two and then here it's uh, it's it's one no this is one this is one from two to one but now it's below one but if you look since the inception max uh look uh, bitcoin cash uh, the peak in the beginning, Bitcoin Cash was more valued versus Ethereum. Here it goes to two to three. It is about a two to three. But then it goes to one to two. Huh? One, two. But two is always a high end. Two, and it goes back to one, one. Uh, but now it's the first time it shoots below one. So it's historically cheap, Bitcoin Cash versus Ethereum. Um, so that's what I'm still doing, flipping. But I'm not building my crypto investment plan my plan is still the same to wait for the correction before i invest more fiat into uh into uh into crypto um i should update this let me do that for the investment plan 
Uh, that means that um, I updated um, still the same target, 60% undervaluation. Uh, uh, that's to go to the line of 40% valuation versus the trend line. We hit this once. Um, but I think it's probable that we will hit it, that we will go sideways here, um, just like we went here sideways and here, and that we will go deeper sideways. That's been the trend. So um, um, that's why I think that. Um, well, what you saw, of course, this was the bottom also in March uh, of the global stock markets collapsing. And uh, the global stock markets also went to a pullout, crypto also, from a low of 120 billion to now 360 billion, as times three. Um, but on this white line, um, that's why I plotted double here. The white line is um, uh, very... Uh, is more difficult to analyze it's easier to analyze the yellow line um, it shows more movement and on the white line you see oh we went up a bit again but on the yellow line you see we went up strong um, but uh, yeah it's always comparing to the red line and um, it's very interesting um, so for the investment plan, um, when I update the numbers also of the MR, MVRP ratio, um, uh, for Bitcoin Core it's 1.8, which is uh, 1 is fairly valued, you could say, 1.8 is overvalued. For Bitcoin Cash it's 1.1, so you could say it's fairly valued. So yeah, the green line is the uh, upper band and the lower band. And I think, you always you see, we always go closer to the green line. So I think, yeah, we're likely going to go back to this green line here and stay and, and hit this green line a couple of times before we go parabolic again. Uh, so I'm bearish on crypto and I think it's important to stick to my plan, which is very difficult. Petrolo recommends only 30% uh, allocation in crypto today. Um, and I am uh, over that. I'm at 50% uh, now. I was at 40% uh, a month back, but crypto has gone up a lot. So now I'm at 50%. That's the, the genius of investing uh, according to the Kelly criterion is that if you're wrong, uh, and let's say you're underinvested, like it's certainly possible for me. I was only 40% a month ago, and I was wrong because since then it went up a lot uh, from 250 billion to 350 billion market cap. Uh, but in my in my portfolio, that also means it goes up. It goes from 40 to 50% allocation. So even if you're under allocated, if you hold if you hold onto a position, uh, it will become an, uh, 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 from. Uh, Small allocation, it will become a big allocation automatically. So, um, but to buy more is not wise for me because I'm already over the 30% as recommended. I'm at 50. So I can just wait. And actually, it's a good time to spend uh, crypto, I believe, uh, because yeah, it's likely you can pick them back up cheaper to, uh, in the future. So that's what I'm doing, don uh, donating more Bitcoin Cash or, or investing more in projects using my Bitcoin Cash. Converting Ethereum into Bitcoin Cash, that is, uh, has a great uh, ratio today. So, um, but yeah, hoping uh, that um, um, we do get more corrections in crypto and then allocating more from maybe it will drop from the 50 or 60% I have now to maybe back to 40 or 30. And then if we do indeed reach, for example, this 60% undervaluation again, that would mean around 200 billion today. Um, then go back to a majority crypto. Yeah, that's my plan. Um, and, and I think for investing in general, it's super important not to chase investments that run away. Okay, sometimes you have to like, you have to follow your logic, but also your gut and also your feelings. And sometimes you feel like, okay, this is a great investment, but I have to market by because it's starting to run away. But the opportunity is still amazing. I'm going to market by and by on the way up. Um, 
you can do that i've done that and, and sometimes you need to do that but it's rare most of the time um you're too early anyway uh in the opportunity uh and you can just um set your buy orders lower than market price and wait for them to be filled up uh that's the best approach that's not chasing but waiting for your prey to fall into your trap uh that's the right way to invest also on the way up to put higher sell orders uh so that's what i'm doing when i'm shorting gold for example now um i have higher sell orders at a higher price and i hope they will be filled up and i want to also go long maybe more stocks like the ARK Invest Fund, or maybe coal miners, um, uh, or maybe Lemonade, an insurance company. Um, yeah, maybe, uh, but I think I, I, I'm going to try to buy those on the way down. If the stock market's correct, which is also a probability that's higher than 50% now. Thanks for watching.